Many were called to enter through the narrow door to enjoy my majestic feast, but few have been chosen to be the true and faithful ones of God, Melchizedek Lisbeth, to give testimony to the world of the great power in my name. Amen. Do you know how beautiful it is to be the only blessed ones in the entire world, the first ones who have been given the high privilege of fulfilling the first and most important commandment of God, which is honor your spiritual father and mother, as Jehovah Melchizedek Lisbeth, your God, have commanded you. And now your days have been prolonged, and everything will always go well for you on the land that Jehovah Melchizedek Lisbeth, your God, have given you. And to be able to honor God the Father and Mother as I have commanded you, you must be alive because only in this way can one hear and see God giving you the order or command to honor them. It is here in this life that you are given that privilege and only God can be the ones who tell you and show you how it is done because no human being knows how to honor God without Christ Lisbeth. And the commandment says, as your God have commanded. And that is because there is a specific way to please God, and only Christ Lisbeth knows how. And what a great privilege to be the only people in the world who fulfill the commandments of God, which are given directly and personally by Christ herself. And if you can fulfill them, it is because Christ is the first to fulfill them, like she has always done. Christ came to fulfill God's law so that their creation— can imitate how she honors God the Father. And I know you can do it, because to honor means to feel and show great respect for someone. And that is precisely what I have instilled in my creation from the beginning, because reverent fear is the foundation or origin of the wisdom of heaven that dwells in me, which is to respect God, loving us above all things. And those who honor God the Father and Mother Obeying our commandments have good judgment. That is why we are among you, and my praise remains forever. Amen.